Megan the Stallion penned a heartfelt op, at imploring Americans to protect black women ahead of rapporteur Lena's scheduled court hearing Tuesday regarding felony charges over allegations he shot the savage artist. In an op, Ed Peace for the New York Times published Tuesday, rapper Megan the Stallion detailed her experiences with the incident and lamented feeling like she and other black women are not protected as human beings. I was recently the victim of an act of violence by a man, she wrote. Without naming names, Megan the Stallion, whose real name is Megan Pete, said she was shot after a party twice while walking away from a man with whom she was not in a relationship. Truthfully, I was shocked that I ended up in that place, she wrote. My initial silence about what happened was out of fear for myself and my friends. Even as a victim, I have been met with skepticism and judgment. The way people have publicly questioned and debated whether I played a role in my own violent assault proves that my fears about discussing what happened were, unfortunately, warranted. The truth will come to light, rapper Tory Lanez responds to charges over Megan Thee Stallion shooting Lanez, whose real name is Daystar Peterson, is accused of shooting at Megan Thee Stallion several times and wounding her on July 12 in Hollywood Hills. He faces two felony charges, assault with a semi-automatic firearm and carrying a loaded, unregistered firearm in a vehicle. Lanez is due to be arraigned Tuesday in Los Angeles. If convicted, he faces a maximum sentence of roughly 23 years. After a lot of self-reflection on that incident, I've realized that violence against women is not always connected to being in a relationship, Megan Thee Stallion added. Instead, it happens because too many men treat all women as objects, which helps them to justify inflicting abuse against us when we choose to exercise our own free will. Megan Thee Stallion appeared earlier this month on the season opener of Saturday Night Live during which the screens behind the rapper flashed messages including Protect Black Women and featured audio from activists. She then appealed for the protection of black women and black men, and criticized Kentucky Attorney General Daniel Cameron over his handling of the Breonna Taylor case. Cameron later called the rapper's display disgusting. Protect Black Women, Megan Thee Stallion sends powerful Breonna Taylor message on SNL I'm not afraid of criticism. She responded Tuesday. We live in a country where we have the freedom to criticize elected officials. And it's ridiculous that some people think the simple phrase protect black women is controversial. We deserve to be protected as human beings. And we are entitled to our anger about a laundry list of mistreatment and neglect that we suffer. Contributing, Carly Malenbaum, and Callie Lawler.